This is a daily encouragement for Friday, March 6, 2020. The verse comes from Luke 1, 48 through 49, New King James. For he has regarded the lowly state of his maidservants. For behold, henceforth all generations will call me blessed. For he who is mighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. Highly favored one, blessed among women, is the title of today's devotion. And it starts with a poem by W.C. Smith. Then the spirit of the highest and a virgin meek came down, and he burdened her with blessing. He painted her with renown, for she bore the Lord's anointed for his cross and for his crown. To call Mary the mother of Jesus blessed is not to worship her, it is rather to worship the one by whom she was so notably blessed, the mighty one who did great things for her in making her the mother of his son. While rightly refusing to worship her, we have sometimes been wrongfully reluctant to call her blessed. To call her blessed is to mark the example of her godly life. We should note her transparency. Mary wondered what kind of greeting this might be. Her purity. How will this be since I am a virgin? Her spirituality. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. Her patience. His mother treasured all these things in her heart. Her endurance. A sword will pierce your own soul. Her meekness and self-effacement. She is present in the upper room at Pentecost, and then we hear her name no more. God sent his Son, says Paul, born of a woman. Galatians 4.4 4. To call her blessed is to accept her advice about her Son. Do whatever he tells you. John 2.5 and pray with me. Holy Father, though she would be the one to bear the Christ child, giving birth to the Savior, who would one day be her Redeemer, you recognized and blessed her with this great task. It was through her that Jesus was fully human, to be one with his full godliness, to be the second Adam, to overcome the sin of the first Adam. Without praise or worship, may we honor her as highly blessed, not because she was in any way holy prior to Jesus' sacrifice, but because she was faithful and obedient, as we all must be. Thank you, Lord, for your blessing on her and through her. Amen. All right, and as always, there's links there if you want to check it out yourself. And there's a link for some good worship. There's an excerpt from the Bible series, Mary, Did You Know? Really excellent song to go along with this. So you guys have a great day. And um, again, click the like if you like. Tell a friend. And uh, leave a comment, question, prayer request. Be glad to hear from you. So have a great day. God bless. We'll see you tomorrow.